Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Chubby Pop Chaser YouTube channel. Thank you for joining me on this adventure of random openings and whatnot. Today, we're going to open up Pops. I know I haven't done it in a while, but we're going to do some Funko Pops. Yes, sir, Pop. So, you know, I have to attack this tower. But don't forget, guys, down below, like, subscribe. Throw, throw a couple comments in there for me, you know. Make me feel wanted. Because I feel lonely. I don't get comments. You know, I may have a thousand, over a thousand view, you know, followers, but I get like three comments. I see people with like 20 followers to get three million comments. Comment me, please. Anyway. Hit the intro. I'm going to attack this tower of goodness here. Let's put the stuff down. Oh, hang on. Some of these boxes I found, you know, cleaning. So I was like, oh, I didn't open this box. I wonder what's in it. So it's like, like this one is from, oh, well, actually, this month. Okay. That one's. Let's open the Funko box first. This is from I'm not sure, but it's from Funko, so it should have date eleven six nineteen. Eleven six nineteen. About a year. It's been sitting on my floor for about a year. I got me Mr. Owl. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Let me see. One, two, three. Three. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Roll Pop? The world will never know. Awesome. Box is in pretty decent shape. I don't see no major dense scuffs or anything else. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, put that one over there. It's garbage. Uh. Oh, from Walmart. This was just a shot in the dark. Try to go for a chase. So I tried. Oh wow, they gave you peanuts. And you know me, I love peanuts. Yay. They're so great. Peanuts. Fantastic. Oh, oh, I didn't get it. I was hoping to put it in backwards, but. Went for the John Wick Chase. Didn't get it. That was just one, one shot in the dark. So, no to that. Keep these boxes just in case I need to sell something. Chips, I get it, that is. Okay, next is this pink one we'll go with. This is probably an eBay buy or Macari buy because it is a recycled box. But anyway, a lot of good pops are coming out, especially now you got your, you got your conventions coming out. You know? Okay, cool. Oh, he even put in a pop protector. How nice of this guy. It's a weird box. It's a weird box. For Amazon. What is this? Greetings from Miami. Lenny Bruce. Gaslight Cafe. Cotton Club. Oh. But this is from the 2020 Galactic Empire exclusive. We got... Concept Vader. You know me? I like my Star Wars. Star Wars. That's cool. There we go. Put that one there. Next, we'll open this one. 
Come on. But yeah. What pops are coming out you guys want to, you know, get? What do you think is the dumbest in line? That's what I want to know. What do you think? What do you think Funko should stop making? What line they should stop making? If they ask me, I think they should stop making chrome ones because it's just ridiculous. Yeah. Like, how many different color chromes do you need? Ah. Oh, this one's a little beat up. Sticker's coming off a little bit. But this is the Galactic Empire Chewbacca. Oh. Oh, no, that's it. Okay. This is the concept of Chewbacca. Show that to you right there. There you go. That's two of the four. There's also a Star Killer. A.K.A. Luke Skywalker and a Boba Fett. So, you know, should I get the rest? I don't know. Like, nobody. I don't think anybody ever really liked Star Killer. You know, it's just just weird. This is an interesting box. Never seen such a box. Pretty cool, actually. Ah, well. Speaking of which. Oh, this is badass. I also got. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The Boba Fett concept. But I got the convention sticker, not the uh, shared sticker. Awesome. Uh, 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 I like it. I like it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Baby, uh, 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 uh. Anyway, sorry. That is awesome. Got the celebration sticker rather than the 2020 Galactic Convention. That's right there. That's dope. That's money right there. I'm going to put this back for now. I'll find a protector. Once I do, you're going in. Put you over there. You can go over here. What's this guy? From Inky Ink. I'm not sure what that is, but let's check it out. So, yeah. I'm going to try to get some more pops slowly. Build a collection again. You know, being that I sold three quarters of my old one. I pretty much sold all the good... The, all the top not ones, except for... Oh, Darth, of course. As you can see, I'm spinning there. This is... Oh, I know what this is. <laughs> Jeff Dunham and Peanut autograph. Can you see Peanut in there? He's like holding him. Careful. Let's, let's see if I can take him out without wrecking anything, which I usually can't because I'm a monster when it comes to opening boxes. Well, folks, I did it again. Apparently, I hit the stop button when I didn't know. And then I didn't realize till the last moment. So, I'm just going to give a quick review of all the stuff I got. 10-inch Indiana Jones, as you can see. Boom. Parks exclusive, Rocket the Raccoon. Star Wars, uh, not Celebration, but Land's End, right? Land's End. Is that what they call it? DJ Rex. Um, I got that Boba Fett over there with the uh, Celebration sticker. I got this Chewbacca. Oh, let me take that down. I got this Chewbacca here. Concept. Darth Vader concept. So I might as well just get Star Killer. Finish the whole four set, you know. Star Killer, if you guys didn't know, was the original name of Luke Skywalker. Or Star Killer. Um, Jeff Dunham. Autographed. With a little peanut in there. Pretty cool. 
pretty cool. But, uh, sorry about that for being clumsy again. I got to pay attention more because, once again, I hit, you know, stop button and it stopped and sorry. Horrible. But, um, these three things I got from my, my friend Pete. He's a super avid Disney fan. Size you can see me. He's a Disney fan, and he was going down during my birthday. He's like, "What do you want for your birthday?" And I told him, "Hey, if you find any exclusive pops, grab them for me." And boom, he found me three. Thank you very much, Peter. Um, he's also a firefighter. Does a lot for you know people that you don't know. You are a true hero, my friend. Not just saying that because I want more pops next time we go. I'm just telling you. But anyway, once again, folks. Stay in school. If you're in school, learn because in the long run, it's going to be worth it. You know, be safe, wear a mask. Chubbop Chaser is out. <laughs>